I think you go early with your best player, so Harry Kane. So nothing says World Cups more than the tension of a penalty shootout. Mm -hmm. uh, you're a man who's experienced them. What's your advice? Well, I think you go early with your best player. So Harry Kane, in terms of your best goal scorer, your best striker at a penalty, he goes first. Then I'd go second, I'd go Ashley Young, taken penalties before, experienced. Then I'd go Trippier. Um, Good with dead balls. Dead balls specialist. Then I'd go Deli Ali as my number four. And then I'd leave it to the young man, Mr. Confident, Marcus Rashford, to win us this game. Yeah, I mean, I think the key things from my point of view with penalty shootouts is try and win the toss, because the teams that win, who take the first penalty, tend to do better than mm -hmm. teams that take the second penalty. I think England have obviously got two main regular penalty takers in the squad, which is Vardy and Kane. Mm -hmm. So you might think about bringing on Vardy yeah. later on in the game. Please. Champions League final for us as well. The manager brought Ryan Giggs on late on in the game, knowing penalties was going to be around the corner, and he, he ended up scoring one. So mm -hmm. it, I think it's vitally important. That's got to come into consideration when you're picking your team. So if you win the toss, you take the first penalty, and your third penalty tends to be the one that's easily converted. Um, you've gone for Trippier in that position. Still mm -hmm. happy with that? Yeah, I am. I think he's been fantastic from dead ball situations. I think he's been our most productive player. So I'd be more than confident in him sitting there.